Hey everyone, it's Lisa, and today I thought I would do just a quick, it won't be quick, <laughs> I'll just do a video on some updates, and I've gotten some really, really neat jewelry this week, and I know I said I wasn't going to do a haul, but I just can't resist showing it to you in case I think a lot of it you guys will really, really like, so I wanted to and share it with you. And I just wanted to make sure that and all of you knew about the Hourglass Christmas event that I am going to be participating in. Let's see, tomorrow the 16th, it's going to be in Raleigh, North Carolina at the Sephora at Crabtree Mall from 1 to 6. And then I'm going to go to Charlotte, North Carolina at the Sephora in the North Lake Mall from 12 to 5 I hope that on all Saturday. of you come out there. And everyone who stops by the Hourglass counter, while supplies last, you get a trial size of their mineral veil primer which is award-winning everybody i've ever heard talk about that primer has just loved it i've only had a sample and i used every bit of it and that is going to be one of the things that i get this weekend it makes your foundation last longer it's just i could go on and on and on about the good things it has a titanium dioxide it has a lot of good ingredients in it and um, so if you stop by and come see us then you will get one of those samples as long as we have some to give out and um, so I wanted to remind you of that, and I wanted to touch base with you on my the blonde shampoo. A lot of people had asked me what my hairdresser said about the Bumble and Bumble, and I did take it back. I knew that you know I was not going to get a refund because when you buy from a boutique, they don't usually do that. But I just wanted to give it back to her because I thought if her or her assistant has really platinum hair, I thought if they wanted to use it, I would rather do that than it just sit there and not get used or throw it away. And they really, she said that that was really a clarifying shampoo and she was, I, I, I know she believed me, but she said that she uses it and it doesn't do that to her. And she said, well, let me use it on you today. And I told her I was just scared to use it again because I just liked my hair so much more before I used that shampoo. So what she did is she used this on me that day, which is the L'Oreal Colorist Collection White Violet Shampoo with Botanical Extracts. Um, neutralizes yellow and brightens pale blonde and white hair and she gave this to me so and I believe that I have seen this in Ulta I'm not sure I'm gonna look and find out for sure but um, so this is what she recommends and this is what she used on me that day and I like it so I haven't used it at home yet but I'm pretty sure this is gonna be much better so that's what she gave me there and while I was there Tuesday night with Brooke she has hired or not hired she has put in her boutique a stylist and his name is Stephen and it's funny because he was at the Laura Mercier counter so I already knew Stephen and he watches my videos and everything and he is going to while you're getting your hair cut which is this is so dangerous so not only are you getting your hair cut but then you can shop for makeup and now they have a stylist there that while you're getting your hair done, he can go pull things from all of the boutiques that are around there, including the one that I go to all the time. And he can do, you know, bring things to you and, you know, do what stylists do, just like Rachel Zoe or whatever. So I told him that I pretty much had everything. I had gotten several new pairs of jeans and everything lately. And I asked him, why don't he go pick me out some accessories? And I just think it's neat when someone else picks something out for you because it's something different than you would have picked out. And it just is different. I just like it. So these are the things that he picked out for me that night. The first thing is this bracelet, which I like because you know I love turquoise and gold. And I love the shape of it. Let's see. And that's one thing that I like is that it's small. My wrists are small and it just packs a really big impact and I love the way that it goes in and out and so I really love that and I love you know like the punch of color um, even with this outfit you could do it so he got that for me and then this is something I probably would not have picked up or chosen but he explained why he liked it and it's this ring and it's one of these stretchy rings and he said because my hands are small the dimensions look good, like the, the shape and the color, and it's just something different, something eye-catching. And I do think that it is, and I love the color. So, got that. And then this is one I really love. This is something I would have looked at myself. And it's 
another one of those stretchy type rings that's a little different. And this has the green stone. I'm not sure what that would be called. I should know because Brooke has always loved rocks and my mom has gotten her several books. And when she, my mom goes to these jewelry and gun shows and stuff like that that she goes to with my dad, she's brought her back a lot of neat rocks. But this is really pretty on. So I love that. <laughs> So those are the things that the stylist chose for me. And then I'm gonna show you what I have gotten this week because I am so excited. One of these things I'm, I just love so much, I know you're this gonna love it. This is something that I got yesterday. And it's one of those things that, it's like a purse or a pair of shoes or something. It's like, I just have been so excited over it. And every time I look at it, and I've looked online and you can get these online. Um, the brand is Lee Elena and I will put the brand brands of all of these including this bracelet I found out the designer of these down below I'm not going to try to put them in annotations I'm just going to put them down below but this is the bracelet and it is a um, genuine python made in the USA and the price was 109 and there it is the cuff and it's so neat how you put it on you just pull this out and then put it on and it fits snug i love that okay i had and to do this myself just, so you had you put those together and then that pin slips right back in there and locks it and i just think these are gorgeous and i loved they had they have all different colors and they even have i'm not sure but i think they had some that were a little thinner but i just loved that color and i just felt like it would go with anything and i just loved how snug it fits so that was one of the things I got, and um, I, like I said, I'll put all the designers down below. This is one of the below. things that I got last Friday night. John took me back into my favorite little boutique, and the designer of this is, he is from, actually from Canada, I believe. I'm pretty sure. Let's see. Yes. Yes, he, is, um, he grew up on a farm in Canada, and his name is Dean Davidson, and... This is the necklace that I got from him. I just think it is gorgeous. And as you can imagine, I got a lot of this stuff to wear this weekend to my meet and greet, but I just love that design and it looks beautiful on. And this necklace was, let's see, 125 for that. And then from that same designer, and this is gorgeous. So many of you are going to love this. And you can see it has the D for Davidson. But this is a bracelet. And this one is tough to get on. But it goes right on your wrist like that. And then that little bar goes in the other bar. And then it clasps. And it looks like that. And it's I love the way it's snug. I mean, like that's how it fits. And I love it. So it's real easy for layering. And I just think it's just gorgeous. I fell in love with that piece. And then the last thing that I got from him, oh, let's see, and this bracelet was 143. And then this I love, and I saw these on his website. And this is 143 also. And I can't remember what these are called, but there are several different colors, but it's a ring. And I just love it. Fits so good. And I think it just fits my hand. Even though it's big, it just doesn't overpower my hand like probably some of the other rings. But this is a little bit nicer jewelry. The other was really, really costume. And this is more of a nice piece that I'll have for a long time. And I just love the color. Look at the all the sparkle and everything or the texture in the blue. Okay, so that was all from the Davidson. David Davidson, I think, <laughs> designer. Like I said, I'll put it all down below. Um, the designer of this bracelet and the other one that I have shown you that is, my other one is like an ivory color. Her name is Farah Karina and she lives in Florida, but she does have a, I looked her up last night and she does have a Facebook and a blog, I believe. I know a Facebook and so maybe you could get a hold of her and um, order that way. And then the last brand that I'm going to show you, one of the girls that works at the boutique, Gloria, was always wears stuff from this designer, and I love it. And it's called Axe and Apple. So there you go, it's the Axe and Apple. And 
this, I'm, as soon as I show this to you guys, you're gonna just have to have it. But this is a bracelet. And you start off putting the bar like that, and then you just wrap it around. And you can see it's all different designs and textures that wrap around. And then you just take the hook and hook it onto, let's see if I can do this by myself. I don't think that I can. So you hook it onto that. And so the bar kind of goes across your wrist and the rest just hangs like that. So it's a wrap bracelet, but it's just so neat. I hope you can see all the different textures. And then that just kind of hangs like that. And this has the has a coin. Like a lot of their jewelry will have a coin, which I am a sucker for coin jewelry anyway. And that's kind of like their signature thing is the coin. So that's that. And I cannot see. find how much this bracelet was. I see a sticker here for 114, and I'm not sure if that was it or not, but it was probably right around that price. And so that is the Accent Apple bracelet. And this is the necklace that I got to go with it. And you can see it has the coin and then it has all the different kinds of metals and you just slip it right over I your love head it. and you get so much show out of it and there's just so much detail. That is that. And it even has this little spiky thing on it. And I just love the coin. And so that goes with that. Okay, so I hope that maybe you saw something that you like and that you will enjoy. I know a lot of you have gotten the Ben Amoon jewelry and you love it. My sister-in-law, I just got the long necklace like mine for her. She wanted it and I sent it to her. And um, so, oh God, this was one more thing. And this was inexpensive. This was $20. But I just thought it would look cute with um, just layered with some other things. And gosh, I'm not sure who the designer is to this. But um, if I can find out, I'll put it below. But I don't know if they had any more of these. Seems like this was the only one. But I thought this would look good just layered with your watch. So... And so I'm going to do a quick outfit of the day this and let you guys go. I've gotten this week too. This is a sweatshirt and it is from the Circle T Los Angeles brand. You guys probably remember I've got another short sleeve sweatshirt this brand before and I love it. It's just really, really soft and I just love this color and love it. And then these jeans are the, let's see, Current Elliot and they are the. What am I, let's see, they're the leopard, and the color of them is, I'm having a hard time thinking of that word, camel. The camel leopard jeans. And I also got some new shoes. I'll show them when I back up, and then I'll show them up to you. Okay, so to you up these close. are the camel colored leopard skinny jeans, and you should be able to find them easy. And then this is the Circle T sweatshirt. And the jeans I did order, when I read the reviews and I called and asked my girls at the boutique, I ordered these and I actually got these off of eBay. Um, you have to order one size down if you want them to fit, like they fit plenty big, but they do run just a little big, so these are a 28. And then these are some new shoes that I just got the other day at Dillard's and I will show them, up, show them to you up close. But they are the Gianni Beanie brand, and they are just fabulous. I love them, and they are very, very comfortable. So, and they had them in black. I think I'm gonna get the black ones today because I love the open toe, and I just love them. So, hey, okay, and for accessories, looks like I have forgotten to put on some earrings. But let's see. <laughs> I don't know if you just heard John yawn in there. Are you tired, baby? Um, but I need to put some earrings on. Let's see. I'll probably put on. Oh, I know what I can put on. And I didn't. I meant to show you these. This is something my mom picked up for me when she was Christmas shopping. And she had not gotten me anything for my birthday because she didn't want to give me money. She said she wanted to wait until she saw something that she liked. And she got me these. And they are just rose gold hoops. She said they were sterling silver. I guess they're coated with um, the rose gold. So I'll put those on right now. And um, so this was my birthday present for my mom. I love, as you can tell, I love jewelry. I love clothes. I love makeup. I love perfume. I love anything that girls like. So there's those earrings. Um, hair is just crazy and wild today, and I'm not going to worry about it. Um, 
bracelet that is the Farah Karina, and I'll put her name down below. I got my wedding ring back, and I just love it. I just, I love my wrap, but I really, really love the simplicity of a solitaire, and it's just kind of, um, I don't know, I guess it's sentimental or something, just thinking about when I first got it, how much it meant and how much it still means. So I did get that back, and I just put my wrap in my jewelry box until I want to wear it again. Uh, rose gold, is this the rose gold? Yeah, rose gold fossil aluminum watch. No fragrance yet. And I wanted to just show you again that this is the brand of the sweatshirt. It's called Circle T Los Angeles. And all these brands are usually on Shop Bop and Revolve Clothing. And there's another one too that a lot of you guys tell me about. I can't remember. But, and then these are the current Elliott jeans. And these are called the Stiletto um, Camel Leopard, size 28 is what these are. And I love them. I love printed jeans. So I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. I hope to see some of you this weekend. And if not, I will see all of you probably. Oh gosh, I needed to update you on this. I'm not going to be able to, to take a video or film while I'm in there because of you know, legal issues and stuff, because if there was somebody in the video that didn't want to be, you know, all the stuff like that. But I am going to try to take some pictures of my makeup after Sabelle does my makeup. So I um, talked to her yesterday on the phone, and I'm just looking forward to working with her. And I will see you soon, and have a great weekend. Can you believe Bye -bye. that I forgot to show you guys these shoes? <laughs> I had already put my laptop up and everything, and I looked down, and I was thinking, oh, how much I love these shoes. And I remembered that I didn't show them to you. So here they are, and they are just, I love them. These are the gray. I can't remember. I've already worn them once. I can't remember the exact name of them, but online, I noticed they only had the brown and the black. But in the store, they had the gray and the black. And I think I'm going to go back and get the black today if they have my size. But I got my size 8, like I always do. It's so neat. You put your foot in, and then they zip up the front. And there, you can, I wish you could feel the padding in there on the bottom of the toe. And they are on sale for $79 at Dillard's. And the brand is Gianni Beanie. And if I can remember, I will put the link down below. So I love these. I love this color. If you do have a Dillard's near you, try to get this color because it's so neat how it goes. Like even today, even though my pants aren't gray, it kind of just blends in because it's, you know, I don't know. It's kind of worn looking. So love these and I love the texture and um, they're just so comfortable. And John, I was just talking to John and he couldn't believe that I was not going to do a video tomorrow. He said, oh, well, you should do one right before we leave because I did get some other new clothes and stuff this week. But then I remembered I'm not going to have my makeup on because I am going to Sephora and get my makeup done by the makeup artist there. So I won't be able to see you tomorrow. And that is kind of sad because I've done a Friday haul for so long. But I hope to see you tomorrow in Raleigh. And if I know a lot of you live far away and you can't, but then if not, I will see you on Sunday and let you know how it goes. So have a good weekend and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.